Alrighty, I'm back. Thanks for waiting. I'm trying to make the breaks less boring by adding things. So if you like having the whole random video, um, let me know. Otherwise, I can try and think of doing something else. But yeah, unfortunately the breaks are here to stay. It's like either take breaks or don't stream at all, so... Um, excuse me. There we go. Damn, there's a lot of sticks. It's cool you called your mum? Excellent. That's what I like to hear. Oh yeah, I'm not sure you guys have seen that. I placed a rope here, for easy access. I think it's only really worth using on the way down though, otherwise you get winded really easily when you're just trying to climb up the cave. Climb up the cave, climb up the mountain. Is there stuff here I've neglected to pick up? Possibly. <laughs> right, I'm, I'm gonna live here for now, guys. See you later. Not nah, kidding. Oh, there's a lot of lichen here I haven't picked up. Might be better for the way back down, actually. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way, but I'm just going to double check real quick. Yeah, that's right. I do hug the right wall. I'm just scared of going up there. <laughs> fight the IRL. <laughs> I went up there with far less gear than this before. Far less gear. This is a bloody joyride compared to my first trip up to the peak. We're doing okay. Yeah, but Buggy Wolf. Buggy Wolf's on the other level, bro. You know, I, I don't know of too many wolves that can climb ropes. Um, okay. But if they can, I'd like to see them. Okay, so we climbed that hill for no good reason. But you know, it's, it's good to keep your fitness level up, right? Okay, there is another crate here. Into dusting. Cool, I believe that's another rope I want to climb. Yeah, I have... Oh, I emptied that one, and I searched this one. Cool, what's in here? Anything good? Little bit of food. I think that can stay here for now. That's Timberwolf Mountain. They set up the ropes. They built the cottage. <laughs> uh, you got me there. Okay, I'll have to remember that there is food in that.
kill me casually refuting themselves because they're toasted. Okay. I dig, I dig. Okay, is this the level with the other cave? Almost. If we... oh, we're getting a bit tired, but if we hug the right wall, then we should get there. You mean knife? You posted an arrow to your own comment, bro. <laughs> an older part of the conversation. Sure, sure. Now, there definitely is uh, a wolf on this level. Hey, there it is. But we should be able to just dodge him, I think. He's more interested in the rabbit, anyway. Maybe it bugged? Oh. Let me check Twitch chat on actual Twitch. Yeah, I'm not seeing <laughs> comments in either place. Uh, it's a little bit of a risk climbing up with this level of tiredness, but whatever. We can just have a nap on this second level here. Ooh, it's getting a little bit swayy, lefty righty. Can we stay here? Yeah, we can. Cool. Yeah, we're not feeling so hot. It's alright, we can just have a short nap. You faded into the long dark. Nah, I'm kidding. It'd be pretty funny if the game did actually bug. And that happened, like a wolf randomly climbed up the rope and got me here. I'd be so salty. Yeah, we're definitely feeling tired though. Done a lot of climbing today. You don't see the video moving? Oh. That should have fixed all of the problems. It's an unfortunate glitch uh, when I just get a frozen screen or a black screen or anything like that. It works excellent. Whenever that happens, I have to reload Alrighty. OBS and the game, that and then I have to pause problem. myself again. Thanks, Pyron. So I did manage to get up to this cave, which is like a single rope away from the summit. Really tired us out doing it though, so... Gonna have to sleep for a bit. The weather is not very good outside anyway. You'd be like, oh, pirate exhaustion's nothing, it kills you really slowly. Yeah, but you can't climb ropes. We're done for today. It kills you really fast if you go up a rope. Yeah. The last time I even tried to climb a rope whilst exhausted, I basically could not get up at all. It was really, really slow and you kept like sort of falling down and all this other kind of junk. Hey, at least I stashed some water in here. That was very considerate of me. Thanks, me. Oh, we're actually pretty... Okay. Cool, we'll just rest. Leathers and pelts too? Yeah. I left those curing in here. Because I know that, um, yeah, I was going to be back here eventually. Did I seriously not bring a can opener? God damn it, Pyron. <laughs> okay, we'll eat them later. I know there's one up at the summit. I knew my future self, indeed. I used to main shulk, so I see I see a lot of the future.
cool, let's grab you. Nice. We should be able to get up to the summit easily now. Hey, the weather is even nice. Cold, but it's nice. I can deal with that. Pretty colours? Yeah, true that. If I were James, I would have taken a screenshot already. Wabam. It's unfortunate that the stream froze partway through the um, the quick way up the mountain. Because we're pretty much there already. You can't have both, it's either a storm or it's cold. True enough. True enough. It's a shithole. I mean, yeah, this is the best gear I could possibly have and we're still freezing. That's right, I'm sure we'll be doing it again. I can't possibly get everything down from the summit. I mean, I could in theory pop up the map and show you which way I'm going. And I don't know if you guys want to see a map. Probably not. How are we going? We're pretty good, Nick, all around. A little low on food, but meh. Last time you played, you lasted three days on Stalker, not Mountain Worthy yet. It's a tough challenge. I don't know how it works on Stalker because I haven't done it. But it's definitely not for the faint of heart. Did we actually nearly make it all the way up on a single burst? Nah, nah, not game. Oh, there's firewood here, cool. I said faint of heart, 50 points. <laughs> okay. We take those, we take those points. Hey! Just in case you were wondering why the weather was nice for a total of 15 seconds, there it goes. Alright, so we're back at the summit again. That was ludicrously fast. Love it. See, if you know where you're going, it's not that big a deal. How's the weather? It's a little bit cold. Nice weather points, I wasted them. Yeah. We deal with those. I hear crows over here. I'm going to investigate. Oh, there's crows there too. And there. Am I imagining things? No, I thought I heard crows. Yeah, I told you, you know where you're going. It's not actually that long a trip to the summit. Also, if you've already placed the shortcut ropes. This was a really quick trip. I think I've already seen those frozen corpses before, but I don't know, maybe I didn't pick stuff off them. Off them, rather. <coughs> we'll investigate. That one first? Yeah, that one first.
yeah, pre plenty of crows up here. Flying around people that managed to make it up here. We didn't quite manage to last. Yeah, he's empty. A few feathers, though. You think Knife fell asleep and left? <laughs> yeah, I think we lost him when the stream froze. We might have gone to check on Kimmy Oda's stream. I noticed he was going before. I was like, when is that man not going? If you don't want to clash with Kimmy Oda, you can't stream, basically. It's alright, I'll probably host him when I'm done. He's definitely doing a slightly more hardcore challenge than I am at the moment. Yeah, it is a small community. It's a very nice community. I like it. Oh yeah, there's a rope that I'll probably never need, ever. Well, we're back. Chickity check it. So if you never want to see this arrow again... Nah, jokes, I'm not going to do that. I hardly have any arrows. Yeah. What is he doing? Oh, the Undertaker challenge, where he can loot a select amount of things. Like, I think firewood and rose hips and cattails and stuff, but other than that, it has to be within reaching distance of a corpse. It's pretty tense. Do we take all that? I suppose? I don't think we're ever going to need it. Maybe take like a cleaning kit or two, but yeah. the tools I think we should take. Actually, we probably don't need the 10% hacksaw, that's just a waste of space. Get out. The herbal tea and the coffee. I don't really drink it. At least, not in the game. It doesn't seem all that useful. In real life, I drink quite a bit of both. Food o'clock, boys. So this container is a bit glitched out. By a bit, I mean a lot. Um, yeah, that's... has that seriously, like, disappeared completely? I used to be able to open this. Well, that's interesting. I hope I didn't need anything from there. Threshold was using the coffee for the Sea to Summit challenge. Yeah, I guess that's fair enough. It does, like, reduce your fatigue a bit, which is great if you don't want to stick around. I might look for a can opener real quick. So do you like seven storm lanterns? I like seven storm lanterns. And all that MRE. Good amount of water. Yeah, we'll take those. Take them apart for the cloth. That is a good amount of matches and they're already starting to degrade. Oof. So James was right. It's disgusting. Eighteen percent hatchet is not really worth. I think I have far more cleaning kits than I will ever need. You don't take the MRE? I'll take them. I'm just looking at the rest of the place first. I was trying to find a can opener, but I don't think there's one up here. There's plenty of can openers and stuff at the base, but I don't see any up here, so 
You're making me hurt by leaving it there. Okay, there you go. This is going to be Encumbrance Simulator 2016 pretty soon. Yeah, there we are. Um, yeah, about that. Might have to come back for the like 18 billion storm lanterns and tools. We've got pretty much everything else. How's the weather? It's fine. <laughs> and the rope too. God, we're moving so slowly. I'll drink some of the stuff. Don't poison me, bro. I always tempt fate by drinking the stuff that is the lowest quality first. In Stalker, I would have been punished long ago for that. But this is not Stalker. How are we going for weight? Still pretty slow. I think we're okay, though. <laughs> it's Voyager? Yeah, it's Voyager. This is like the second save file I've ever actually started. <laughs> Aside from a few at the start, where I tried to play Stalker, like, to learn the game, and that failed miserably. So then I started the Transients file on Voyager, and that went pretty well, and then I started this file. But as you can see... Um, oh, never mind. I was going to say, even on... Even on Voyager, I'm freezing. Like, with the best gear in the game, on Timberwolf. Stalker is so hard, yeah. I'll try Stalker eventually. Seb2378, thank you for joining us. If you haven't seen Temple Wolf Summit, bask in the glory, fella. Bask in the glory. Can I eat anything? Have you? There's a pretty good chance we're going to sprain on the way back down. Well, we deal with those. The ropes are going to break. <laughs> Don't say these things, Kilkavi. Don't say these things. Like, can the ropes even break? Let's hope Banjo follows you. <laughs> uh... It's like, I hope you die and fall off Timberwolf Mountain and get eaten by a wolf and then a bear and then shit out by a rabbit. Don't know if they can break, but they might. Yeah, it's hard to say. Oh, we're getting tired as well. That's right, when you get more tired, you can carry less and then you walk slower. Hope you fall on a bear. Oh, that's nicer. I think I'm actually just going to have a short nap here. Try and get the uh, energy up a little bit to go down the rope. <coughs> just because if we get tired then we can carry less and then we walk even slower and yada yada yada, it'll take bloody forever.
But uh, you think you get tired carrying all that stuff? Um, I couldn't carry 50 kilograms worth of stuff. <laughs> but then I'm not a mountaineer. How are we doing? Uh, pretty well, actually. <laughs> no kidding, he needs to stop complaining. <laughs> yeah. Do we know the names of the characters? I don't believe the ones in Sandbox do have names, it's just whatever you name the Sandbox file. Some of the characters in Story Mode do have names. You can see those on the wiki, I don't remember them off by heart. I think there might be a rope in that cave, but I don't really care. Actually, do we really care if there's like a bajillion storm lanterns up at Temple Wolf Peak? I don't think it really matters. You only need one. You might need the metal parts, yeah, true. But I mean, we know the way back to the summit, we can come back for them if it's absolutely necessary, but as far as I know anywhere but Timberwolf Mountain, scrap metal's pretty plentiful, so with any luck we won't. Uh, fuel could be an issue, but... <coughs> I don't know. We'll think of something. This cave was like my de facto base for when I was not at the base of the mountain and could just use the crappy hut. Because this is a nice warm cave. You can sleep here as long as you like. We are moving slowly. Warm caves, that's a trap. If they're enclosed, they're warm. Look how warm it is in here. 19 degrees. I haven't even got a fire on in here. If it's enclosed, it's fine. I've definitely come across some caves that looked warm, but at night time they were freezing. Will Mackenzie and Anna, something or other. Yeah, I don't remember, bro. Anyway, I think we'll... What are we doing? That's right, we're having a short rest in this cave. In the game and in real life. I'll be back in a bit. <laughs> 